Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Harakak Wadash. Those are the names of the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, who the world ignorantly called God in Jesus Christ, whose correct and proper names are Yahweh and Yahweh Shai in the name of the Holy Spirit. I would also like to give a double honors unto my apostles and elders of Great Millstone that have taught me this truth, and I would like to say a sincere shalom unto the hopefully elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the world, unto the servants, the prophets, the men that are prophesying and laboring in this truth and, and in this doctrine. Unto you I say shalom. This wicked generation is tailored for the NWO, the New World Order. All right, that's that that, that that's what's taking place right now. All right, and the, this 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 generation that we're living in these these you know the, these these niggas these these the, the so-called black woman these Mexican niggas these, these Latino niggas these Native American these all they're all tailored to for this new world order. All right, they they they're you know they don't. They don't read anything. They don't think th think things through. They act on emotion. They act on impulse. It's all about this thought, this twerk culture, this this nigga culture. But you know, it's morally mo morally uh, uh, um, you know decayed. You know, our people are the biggest moles. All right, they, and they hate direction. They hate they hate direction. They hate rebuke. They hate you know when you when you tell them that they're going off or they're doing something wrong. This that's that's why this generation has got to be the last generation. These niggas are tailored for the new world order. And, and, and they're gonna do, you know, they're gonna fight the the prophets tooth and nail, all right, to to, to uh 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 to you know to to maintain this place. All right, they're gonna fight against the Lord. Okay, they're gonna fight against his chosen uh, his chosen to uh um you know to to maintain America, to maintain the wickedness that, that takes place here. All right, they follow. They they our people follow wickedness openly, and, and and you know if you don't know what the hell I'm talking about, go to World Star Hip Hop, or go to one of these these you know most of you Jakes is on Twitter or or uh, Instagram, so you see the folly of our people. Okay, it's, it's these women are, are shameless. They just you know go around being hoes, sleeping with 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 uh, you know multiple men, and and it's not a big deal. Okay, this nation, this mainly you Israelites, really you Israelites. Okay, because some of these other nations, they're they're in order to a certain degree, but you Israelites, with the exception of the elect, the hopeful elect, are just bugged out. They're full of pride. All right, you can't tell them shit. That's why this is the the last generation. But you niggas are tailored for destruction. You're tailored for that. The Esau in in you deep down inside, Esau loves you niggas. Okay, because you know you you you'll be the ones that won't resist. Uh, that MOTB, okay, you're the ones that's gonna uh, uh, be get right in line, like you did for that JAB, okay. Like I said, the, you know everything about this this generation, man. And these niggas, they don't. A lot of these niggas, they just they just really bugged out, man. You know, I just you, you, every day you you see this new generation, and, and they really don't have no direction. Their direction is the whatever direction the so-called white man Esau points them in. All right, so let me you know finish with my little rant. And just get into some scriptures because the scriptures could, could could tell you about our people more than I ever could. All right, to tell you how they're destroyed for lack of knowledge. All right, how they're side as children. Okay, but first let me get the words of Yahweh Shai. This is uh the book of Saint John, chapter eight and um forty four. And and Yahweh Shai was cussing these niggas out, man. It's this uh ye are ye are of your father the devil. And the lust of your father ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in the truth because there is no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar and the father of it. All right, you niggas of, the, of, the, of your father the devil. Okay, you guys walk hand in hand with this devil in their wickedness, in their pride. All right, to, to, and you're ultimately destroying yourself because Esau don't give a shit about you. That's what a lot of our people are going to realize. All right. If you haven't realized it through this pandemic, all right, through uh, uh um, you know, um, you know, you know, it's a, a a big outrage about social injustice right now. These devils don't care about you. They're they're ever going to see you as equal. All right. When all actuality, you 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 you're, you're a, a a higher people. You Israelites above these people are above above Esau, above all the nations. Okay. But you are hey, right now. Two thirds of our people are of your father, the devil. All right. Esau, Edom. OK, and you're going to hey, you're going to receive that judgment of them. All right. Because when correction was hit, when correction was presented to you, what did you guys do? All right. You, you talk shit. 
all right, you you um you know you 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 basically scoff at the prophets, all right. You're gonna lie on the prophets, all right, and and we know this is coming, okay. But this this generation, like the title of the letter, is tailored for the new world order, all right. They're gonna get in line with this the democracy, one world, one world government, one world a uh, 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 religion, one world um. Um, one world uh, uh, medicine, all right, our, our, this new generation is going to be in league right with it, and there's going to be no resistance from it. It may be a resistance from a few, but but re not really, okay, because everything everything in this everything in this world is tailored to them now, all right, iPhone this, smart this, okay, uh, uh, um, you know, everything, everything is on your phone, everything, everything is instant gratification like Esau, going back to Esau's blessing. All right. Even before the blessing, when he he was uh, he when, when uh, what is it uh, Genesis the twenty fifth chapter? Okay, Esau was uh, uh, about to he was faint. He was felt like he was going to die. He wanted the fast meal. All right. So he said, you know, I'm you know, and he, that's when he sold his birth birthright. All right. I'm not going to go into it, but you can read Genesis the twenty fifth chapter, and it tells you about Esau and how he despised his birthright. That that's hey, that's our people. Two thirds of our people they they despise the words of the Lord. They despise the prophets. OK, um, and the closer and closer we get, you're going to see our people bug more and more out. All right. They, they're going to just do this, do the, you know, the most wicked, degenerate shit that you've ever seen. It's, it's going to get worse and worse and worse. All right. But those that believe, those that have faith, those that have eyes to see, those that can see this place crumbling and falling before their eyes, you, you know what time it is. All right. You know, hey. If you got family members, if you got friends, all right, fam, uh, uh, um, your friends' kids, or whoever it may be, they're more than likely going to die unless they repent. They're going to perish unless they repent. This is uh, First, Second Timothy chapter three and one. This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come, all right, and, and we're in those last days, and perilous times are coming, all right, and they're going to hit our people, Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. And the Israelites scattered amongst the heathen nations. They're going to hit them the hardest. Okay. Verse 2. For men shall be lovers of themselves, covetousness, bolsters, proud, blasphemers, disobedience to parents, unthankful, unholy. All right. Lovers of themselves. Uh, uh, um, you know, it's all about me. It's all about what, 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 what someone can do for me. All right. Covetousness, bolsters, proud. That's our people. Proud as hell. How the hell are you proud? You niggas is proud. All right. You women are proud. And we in the lowest conditions. All right, we in the ghettos. We, you know, we live in, we're in captivity. But you niggas is proud. Is proud. Blasphemers. All right, they blaspheme the Yahweh Bashim Shai all day long. All right, with the with the images they put up of them. All right, how they blaspheme his prophets, blaspheme his word, disobedient to parents. There's niggas out there, the so-called black women, you know, you 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 uh, you young Israelite men that'll fight your parents, that'll sit up there and have a fist fight with your parents. Okay. Hey, that, that, in, our, in our law, you raise your hand to your parents. Hey, you're supposed to be put to death. Unthankful, un, you know, you could, with unthankful, you could put ungrateful. All right, unholy. All right, that that that's our people. Our people like to, uh, and we're supposed to be holy. We're supposed to be separate from these nations and the ways of Esau. What do our people do? All right, our people cleave unto the ways of the devil and to the ways of the heathens. All right, verse three, without natural affection. All right, it's a lot of a lot of our people, you know, are are into that that uh, 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 backwards, you know, homo lifestyle. Okay, truth breakers, false accusers, liars, incontinent, fierce despisers of those that are good, and that's our people. Our people are wicked to the core, and they despise those that are are, are trying not to be wicked. Those that are. Um, those that are, um, you know, uh, 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 trying to return to the Lord, they they will say, "Oh, nigga, you ain't you ain't shit." All right, you know what you think you better than me? That's how our people think. All right, they 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 love wickedness. All right, they love to 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 um, you know, they 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 love to just uh, um, they glory in wickedness. All right, like the devil. Okay, um, traitors, heady-minded, lovers of pleasure. More than lovers of the Most High, they love pleasure. Our people love gratitude. They love, uh, 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 um, you know, not gratitude. They love um, uh, compliments. All right, they love to the, the, the hear that they're this and that, they're that. You know, the, our people are just full of themselves, and they really, they just a lot of them are full of shit. 
All right, and you're going to see the closer and closer we get. All right, as as the judgment goes out, you're going to see the pride even go get higher. All right, and and you could just tell. Look at the look at the um, you know, all these rappers in the past two or three years that have been you know been 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 um gunned down, been getting judged. All right, and these niggas, these these nigga rappers are even more prouder than ever. All right, they say, well, shit, it can't happen to me. They don't get caught slipping. Hey. You're going to see a lot of these niggas get caught slipping because the wrath of the Lord is coming down, all right? And, and, it, and it's it's not going to be no mystery who did it at the end of the day. It ain't going, it ain't going to be your ops. It's going to be your Hababashim Yahweh Shai, all right? Because he's opposed to all you niggas and your wickedness, all right? Let me grab this because it, it, this everything is being made clear right now, okay? You can see who the prophets are, the true prophets, all right? You can see... You know, if you have eyes, you can see what the hell is going on. And a lot of our people don't. They got their head up in the air thinking that, you know, they nose up in the air thinking that they shit don't stink. Okay? And that's this 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 new generation, man. You know, and a lot of these old bottle niggas too. All right, niggas that's 30 and 40, they 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 they, they, they they're part of that they're they're part of that generation that's tailored for the NWO too. Okay? Because the, the, hey, they they down with the beast. They down with Esau. All right, when it's all said and done, they're going to take that MOTB because they want to preserve their life here in America and wherever you Israelites dwell. All right, they, 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 this niggas out there still trying to get ahead, okay? While the Most High is tearing this place down. This is the book of Luke chapter 12 and 54. And he said, and he said also to the people, when ye see a cloud rise out of the west straightway, ye say, there cometh a shower, and so it is. And when ye see the south wind blow, ye say, there will be heat, and it cometh to pass. Ye hypocrites, how can ye discern the face of the sky and the earth, but how, but how is it that ye do not discern this time? And we're living in those times all right, where, where you're seeing not only judgment, you're seeing pestilence, all right, pestilence that stopped the whole world. And, the, and they, everyone wants to consider... All these other things but the Lord, all right? Oh, it's China. It's this. It's this. Hey, it's the Lord that did that, okay? Whether it's manufactured a pandemic or not, it's the Lord that 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 um, put everything into action. And people don't consider that, okay? You got uh, um, uh, uh, major droughts all across the world, okay? Um, and, and that's going to affect your, the water supply in, in a lot of these places, okay? Um, droughts, uh, uh, um a potential famine that's taking place. All right, people don't people don't realize what the hell's going on. They just go in the store, buy what they need, and, and leave, not knowing that the prices is, is steadily rising. All right, but hey, they these niggas don't have a care in the world until that time comes when they gonna they're gonna want to care about everything and everything going on. But it's it's gonna be too late. For, it's going to be too late for a lot of them. All right, they can see all these bullshit. They can see, you know. Um, you know, everything that's going on in pop culture and sports and, you know, just nigga culture, but they can't see what the hell's going on, what, what's really going on in this world. All right. Um, let me grab this Hosea four and uh, verse six. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge because thou hast rejected knowledge. I also reject thee that thou shall be no priest to me, seeing that thou hast forgotten the law of thy power. I also I also forget thy children. That's plain, all right? Our people are destroyed for, for lack of knowledge because the knowledge that they seek, the knowledge that they adhere to is the knowledge of this world, the knowledge of getting the bag, the knowledge of, um, you know, uh, this, this man's society and this man's philosophies, all right? They don't seek unto the true knowledge, all right? The, the true knowledge that is able to save your soul, all right? That, that, that is this truth. That is the loss by, by following the law, statutes, and commandments, to the best of your ability, all right. They don't want to do that. They want to do what they want to do. They want to, um, uh, um, they want to, uh, uh, yeah, pretty much do what they want to do. Follow their own vain heart and their own vain opinions. Um, let me grab. Uh, let me grab this. Jeremiah four and verse twenty two. For my people is foolish, they have not known me. They are sadist children, they have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. Our people are wise to go rob a nigga. All right, our people are wise to go sleep with another man and, and, and rob this man. 
Okay, our our, our, our women are wise to go sleep around and sleep with uh, uh your, your your man's best friend, and you know, um, you know, just 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 you know, be engulfed in wickedness. But they don't want to do good. They don't want to. Um, these women don't want to have this one man. These these niggas don't want to stop eating abomination. They they don't want to uh, stop robbing the next man or, or 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 chasing the bag or selling some drugs or you know whatever these niggas do. All right, the these women don't want to stop putting up you know a uh, 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 twerking on camera and shit. They 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 don't they don't want to do good. They they just want to live a wicked nigga life, and that's and that and that lifestyle is catching up with a lot of them. All right, and. and it's gonna it's gonna be a beautiful day when a lot of these niggas start to get start to get judged. Damn. Um, let me see. This is Proverbs chapter sixteen, and I was going into the pride of our people. All right, people are very prideful. All right, but they're gonna fall right on their face. This is uh, Proverbs sixteen and eighteen. Pride goeth before destruction, and a haughty spirit before fall. And and that pride is is is. Is really high, especially amongst our women, okay, and, and, and the men too. All right, but really our women—they're prideful as hell. You can't tell them shit right right now, okay. And and, and but that the hey, their pride goes before destruction and the haughty spirit, and I, they're haughty also. All right, they 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 got their nose up in the air. You can't tell them shit. All right, but when that day comes, when they're gonna need a man. All right, all those women out there that don't need a man, and they got their own money, and all these 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 uh. uh these women on on what is this shit? Uh, Only fans and you getting money from this nigga and this nigga and all, all that shit gonna come to an end. All right, you're gonna be humble, but it, hey, it's gonna be too late. You're gonna be humble. All right, all you women out there that, that that are proud right now, you're gonna be humble one way or another. All right, and, and it's best you start to humble yourself now before the Yahabah Shemayah Shai humble your ass. And that humbling is gonna come in the form of a, a, a serious judgment. And no one's and. and no one wants to talk about these things, all right. No one wants to talk about judgment and and and, and being accountable, all right. That, that's that's the main problem with our people. They, our people all don't want to be accountable, all right. They they want to just they want to be wicked niggas and just sweep sweep all the wickedness under the rug when the Lord comes. When the Lord says, you know, uh, uh, when 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 your sins become your accuser in that day, as the Scripture says in Second Ezra's um, sixteenth chapter. Okay, this yeah, your your sins and your wickedness is gonna is gonna come back. All right, the most high I ain't forgot. This is uh second Ezra chapter eight and verse fifty. For many great miseries shall be done to them in the latter times that dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. Hey, that's our people. Walking in that great pride. Pride goeth before destruction. All right, that's that and that pride shit, you better cut that out, man. You better be trying to be humble and and humbling down unto the Lord. Okay, acknowledging your offenses. All right, you know, and, and and sometimes it's hard, but hey, you know, you gotta you gotta you, you gotta make a choice. Do you wanna, you know, be judged, you know, with this world, with this wicked ass world, or you wanna be righteously judged by Yahweh Shem Shai and delivered and, and 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 have the Lord um, fight for you in that day? All right, because the Lord is not fighting for the no two third niggas out here, man. The Lord is not fighting for. You no know, rapper niggas, you no know, NBA basketball, NFL playing niggas. The Lord is not fighting uh, and preserving no 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 thought no thought culture ass bitches. No no you know all these old hood rat assholes out here. You know doing what the hell they want to do. The Lord not fighting for you, okay? Unless you repent. But hey, it's for a lot of our people. It's gonna be a miracle for for you to repent and turn unto the Lord, okay? But and and, and when the time it is, this is the time to repent. But when that time comes, when the Lord cracks those, sky, those clouds and the destruction begins to uh, um, speed up rapidly, it's gonna be too late, man. And it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a beautiful day, man. I can't I can't wait, man. Cause our people are wicked as hell, man. And and, and they, they they really don't know what they're getting into, man. Because the Lord's coming with some serious judgment. Like like we're talking about thousands upon thousands of people dying all at once. Mass judgment. This is Deuteronomy chapter 32 and 20. And he said, I will hide my face from them. I will see what their end shall be. For there are a very forward generation of children in whom is no faith. Our people have no faith. They, like the scripture says, I'm going to grab it. They honor me with their mouth, but their heart is far from me. That's Jake, man. They want to go to church on, on Sunday and be a nigga the whole, uh, the whole uh, other six days of the week. That's Jake right there. That's Jake in a nutshell. You know, want to be a hoe, be sleeping with... You know, uh, a nigga sleeping with multiple women, you know, not with multiple women, a nigga sleeping with their neighbor's wife, 
okay? They 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 they, they, they partner this woman, and then you go to church the next day and repent. And, and and vice versa, you got a woman sleeping with multiple niggas on Sunday, on Saturday, and go and go to church and act like you know she's holier than now. The most high ain't dealing with you. The most high ain't dealing with the Christian church. All right? Because hey, truth be told, the goddamn pastor in the church is doing the same thing. Um, this is uh Isaiah twenty nine. And uh let me see. Uh, 13, wherefore the Lord said, for so much as this people draw near me with their mouth and with their lips do honor me, but have removed their hearts far from me and their fear toward me is taught by the precept of men. The fear of the Yahweh Shem is taught by, 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 not, is taught by the precept of men, the, their own thoughts and their own feelings. All right. And, and that's what makes Jake, uh, uh, you know, the, these preachers know how to say this, uh, the shit that make Jake feel good. And, and they really confusing them. They really destroying them, okay? Because they they follow a man and not Yahweh Bashim Shai, okay? But these niggas, they all they do is say they love the Lord, but are do they really love the Lord? All right, are, are they con confessing His name? Are they you know uh, trying to follow His laws, statutes, and commandments to the best of their ability? No, all right, they're doing what they want to do. What they want to follow their own vain heart, okay? Um, back to. Uh, Second Ezra is eight. Oh, excuse me. Second Ezra is five and one. And nevertheless, as coming the tokens, behold, the days come that they which dwell upon the earth shall be taken in a great number, and the way of truth shall be hidden. And, and the way of truth is is going to be hid. All right, from from two thirds of our people. All right, where they 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 can understand that you're they can understand and and realize you're Israelite, but that's all you may get. All right. Or you may get a little bit, but you're not going to get the whole scoop. You're not going to get 100 percent truth because the, the, the Lord is 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 the, this truth is only preserved for the elect. OK, it says and the land shall be barren of faith. And like the scripture I read in um, Deuteronomy 32 and 28, this this uh, children of whom is no faith. Our people really don't have faith. All right, but our people need tangible evidence. They need to see. They need to see Yahushai and the angels, and, and and see that this is the truth for them to to come into the fold, for them to you know, um, you know, uh, um, you know, come into the truth. All right, hey, we don't have to see. We have faith. All right, we have faith that you know, uh, um, our, our Redeemer. All right, it lives, and, and He's going to save us. All right. Um, let me jump back to uh, Hosea 5 and uh, verse 15. I will go return to my place till they acknowledge their offense and seek my face in their affliction. They will seek me early. Hey, when Jake started to get jacked up, they're going to seek the Heavenly Father. They're going to seek his prophets, but it's going to be too late, too late. Okay. All right, but hey, the Lord has turned his back. Hey, for a long time, he has turned his back on Jake. He turned his back on the whole nation. All right, but those that render that is, has acknowledged their offenses, that, that are seeking the Lord, that have confessed their sins, that um, are repenting, all right, and hey, he's, he's, he's returning unto them, all right, and he's supping with them. He's, you know, he, his spirit is dealing with them now, all right, but those those other ones that, 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 that you know, that don't repent, that continue to... Um, you know, want to be niggas and want to be black and follow black culture. The Lord is, hey, the Lord not dealing with you. He's, 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 his back is still turned to you. Okay. Let me grab this. Um, what is that? Uh, judges. Judges. The book of Judges, chapter 10 and verse 14. Go and cry to the gods which ye have chosen. Uh, no, actually, yeah, let me start at. 13. Yet ye forsaken me and serve other gods, wherefore I will deliver you no more. Go and cry to the gods which ye have chosen, let them deliver you in the time of your tribulation. So Jake is into everything. Jake is into, uh, of course, heavy into Christianity, Islam, all right? Uh, uh, um, you know, some of these bug out niggas worship the woman. Um, our people are into all types of shit, okay? So when the tribulation comes, when your time of trouble comes, go worship those gods which you have chosen, okay? Because the Lord ain't dealing with you, 
All right, go go worship Mary and uh, Guadalupe and and, and and Edomite Edomite Jesus and and, and Allah and, and and Buddha and all these bugged out shit you niggas is in. Okay, let them deliver you, like the Lord said. They they let them nigga, let, let let them let them nigga gods deliver you. Okay, because that that's who you made your covenant with. All right, and really you a lot of you niggas made a covenant with death, man, because you know the the you because. The covenant that you're, that you're making by following this man in this new world order is 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 a, a death covenant. All right, you're gonna die right along with him. Okay, but your your death is gonna come is gonna be what what way worse because you you Israel, you Israelites should know better. All right, you know you have no excuse. Okay, the devil is the, the Esau's wicked. All right, that that's his that's his job. He's hey, he's doing his job. All right, you Israelites are supposed to be righteous and supposed to be holy. Holy meaning separate from the ways of this world, this devil's ways, and in all in all this bullshit. But hey, like I said, our people, they 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 cleave under wickedness. All right, that's why that like I keep repeating the title of this lesson is this wicked generation is tailored for the NWO. Okay, America, freedom, and you know, a uh, 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 rights for everyone. You know, uh, the whole alphabet soup group, all of that shit is, is for this wicked generation. All right. Even whether you you got to be whether you got to be against it or, or you with it. You know, a lot of Jake likes to be say those politically correct answers like, well, you know, as long as they don't come, you know, t you know, by me, I don't have no problem with nobody. No, the most I got a problem with that shit. The most I says that's an abomination. All right. If you don't if you don't feel like the most I you you a foe of the most I. All right. All right. You, you're not you're not with us. If you're not if you're not against this wicked world, this wicked society, you're not with us. Okay, this is uh, Deuteronomy, back, back in Deuteronomy 32, 32, and I'm going to start at verse 36. For the Lord will, the Lord shall judge his people and repent himself for his servants when he see if that their power is gone and there is none shut or left. And he shall say, where are their gods, their rock, whom they trusted? Now, the Most High is going to scoff at you niggas. Okay, where's your, uh, you know. Where's Allah? Where's Buddha? Where's uh um you know all, all these gods that you worship? Where's your money? Is your money gonna save you? Okay, is your gun gonna save you now? All right, is your OnlyFans or, or whatever you women like to do and trick niggas for money that gonna save you? All right, is your simp ass nigga that 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 you know you, that that pay your bills gonna save you? All right, <laughs> that basically that's the most I'm gonna say because you trusted in those things, you trusted in those carnal things, and at the end of the day, you're going to find out they're not going to save you, all right? You may be doing all right right now. You may be put, you know, Jake like to put on this facade like they're doing all right, but when the shit really hits the fan, when you can't eat and it's cold and you ain't got no food, you got kids, ain't your kids ain't eat, you haven't eaten, okay? What are you going to do, okay? Because that, that, that nigga that, you, that you've been tricking out of money, that been tricking on you, he going to be gone. He going to be gone with his real family, okay? Trying to, try to fend for them and fight for them, okay? But, and, and that goes for a lot of you men too, okay? You, you, a lot of these niggas out there, they, they tough and bad, but when shit really hit the fan, your gun ain't going to save you. Your 9, your 45, you, you know, your AK, your AR, that shit ain't going to save you, okay? Only thing that's going to save you is is the, is shit pretty much is preserve you is your how about shot, all right? And if you don't have that covering, hey, you, you niggas is built for, pretty much built for destruction, all right? Hey, the Lord's going to do, hey, you thought, that, you thought Esau did a number on Jake, man. Hey, the most high about to do a serious number on you niggas, man. And, and it's all going to be in righteousness because a lot of you jakes deserve it, all right? Because you guys, a lot of these niggas is juiced in with this devil, man. All right? This, if they feel if this devil goes down, they're going to go down. And, hey, so be it. This is Isaiah 66 and 15. For behold, the Lord will come with fire and with chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. For by fire and by his sword will the Lord plead with all flesh. Plead, plead meaning judge, okay? And the slain of the Lord shall be many. All right, slain. All right, hey, that's simple, man. You know what slain means, you know, all right? Look it up in the Webster's real quick. Uh, slew, all right? Uh, uh, kill a person in a violent way, all right? You, you ain't... You niggas think you're going to just die in your sleep, all right? You No, your Mosai is going to come and judge you niggas in a violent way, okay? 
and it's gonna be violent. It's, it's, it's got to be violent. All right, that's the only way our people understand. All right, they they don't most most sides really being nice right now by by extending his arm and, and sending his prophets out there. All right, but that time is hey that time is coming to an end. All right, where the most high is done talking by the word of his prophets, and it's gonna be time for action. All right, hey the most high and his son are really about that action. All right, um, this is a uh, last verse I'm gonna get. Uh, this is Jeremiah five and twenty one. Hear now this, O foolish people, and without understanding, which have eyes and see not, which have ears and hear not. All right, you 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 a lot of these jakes is, is blind. You lot, you jakes is really blind out there. Whether you got you could see with your eyes, but you really can't see what's going on. You really don't understand what's going on. You really don't, you know, uh, uh, um, you can't hear what's going on. Okay, fear fear ye not me, saith the Lord. Will ye not will ye not tremble at my presence, which I have placed? The sand for the bounds of the sea by a perpetual decree that it cannot pass it, and though the waves thereof toss themselves, yet cannot, yet they they not prevail pre prevail like it. Though they roar, yet can they not pass over it. But this people have a revolting and rebellious heart; they are revolted and gone. Hey, our people are gone, man. That's simple. All right, the Most High controls everything. All right, and, and you know, but Jake still think they they in control. And if they're not in control, they, they, they damn sure believe Esau's in control. And they don't understand that Esau is just a man. And most high controls him. Okay? So, you know, that's all I really had. I just wanted to, you know, you know, just something on my spirit, man. You know, just Jake is just, you know, these niggas is just wicked, man. And it's really only one remedy for, for these people. It's death, man. You know, because they, 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 they don't want to get right. All right? And a lot of them have an understanding and can understand to a degree what the hell's going on. But... It, it, it's just something about this world. It's just something about, you know, the the ways of wickedness that 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 Jay can't let go. Okay, that's why I say they're they're tailored for this, you know, this this new world order because this new world order is 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 nothing but wickedness, nothing but rebellion against the heavenly Father and His Son. All right, and it's and it's a reward. It's it's a heavy it's a heavy reward, or for 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 that for going against the Lord. All right, a, a reward of judgment. So, um, Lord willing, this lesson was edifying unto the elect. And I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Yahweh Until next time, I say shalom.